Hey everyone, Rarity Dash here. Time for another My Little Pony, Friendship is Magic, Season 6, Blind Commentary. And today I'm reacting to Episode 16 of Season 6, The Times They Are a Changeling. <laughs> and I seriously love that title. I, uh, I'm a big Bob Dylan fan, so I, I just really appreciate that. Probably one of my favorite titles ever. Up there with Crusaders of the Lost Mark and uh, Do Princesses Dream of Magic Sheep and some of the other really great titles. <laughs> uh, though, I mean, I liked last week's title and that didn't pan out. Though, yeah, I'll try and put that behind me and just enjoy this episode, and hopefully it'll be a really good one to make up for that. Uh, and it sounds like it just might be, because Changeling in the title, that is, that's exciting. Uh, and a little unexpected. I mean, we saw the Changeling at the end of uh, the premiere, but uh, I, I really wouldn't have expected that to come back until the finale. I, I mean, it it's kind of strange to get a Changeling episode just in the middle of the season. I uh, really wouldn't have ever thought we'd uh, get something like that. But uh, it could be cool. I mean, I don't think we'll see Chrysalis, but maybe that would be awesome. Uh, it, uh, yeah, it, it sounds like it could be an interesting one. Uh, again, I don't really know much aside from who the writers are, and again, it's new writers, uh, Kevin Burke and Chris Wyatt. Uh, don't really know much about them, but... Uh, I'll give them a chance. Hopefully, hopefully they do a better job than the other new writer from last week. Uh, can't do much worse. <laughs> but uh, yeah, this, this I'm looking forward to this episode. Hopefully, it's a good one. And let's just get started and find out. Okay, and here we go. Go into the Crystal Empire. I hope Shiny yep. Armor and Princess Caden still think it's too soon for me to come back to the Crystal huh. Empire. It'll be good to see them again. There will be, so yeah, seeing Flory Heart too. Even her. Starlight. She's the only baby they have. Yay. I think it'll be pretty easy to figure out who she is. <laughs> Sorry, I know you want to visit your niece as much as possible, and I'm excited to see Sunburst again. Oh. I just don't want to fall behind on my friendship lessons back home. Starlight, your work in Ponyville isn't going anywhere. Besides, I think we all know you can learn about friendship anywhere, right, Spike? <laughs> Who's Spike? Okay. Uh, you're Spike, Spike. And why are you dressed like that? Ugh, guys, you're blowing my cover. How'd you even know it was me? Because you're you. Yeah, it's and pretty obvious. Aren't a lot of other dragons around. Right. Spike, why do you need a disguise? Last time we came to the Crystal Empire, there was a lot going on with the new baby and the crystalling, but I still got mobbed in the street. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't say mobbed. And this is just a Yeah, it was kind of intentional. <laughs> want the presence of Spike the Brave and Glorious to turn it into some kind of circus. We get it. The Crystal Ponies adore you. Yeah, you it's brought up a lot. Twice. But still, I don't think your presence will turn our visit into a circus. Not if I find the right disguise, it won't. Uh huh. <laughs> that a reference to something? Sticking with that one. <laughs> I don't think you need to worry about being mobbed. No ponies here. Huh. Well, that's a lot of it's names. Like ghost town. I've got a bad feeling about this. Yeah, this is weird. Yeah. I guess I don't need the disguise after all. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, this is gotten a bit extreme. Yeah, what's going on? Why was every pony hiding? Oh, it sure looks like Princess Twilight in her pupil. 
But how can we be sure? They're not very crystal-y at the moment. Either one of them could be the... you know? Changeling? <gasps> what if this one isn't the real Spike? Everypony run! Uh-huh. Okay, something strange is definitely going on. Uh, you think? Who goes there? Um, you don't recognize the Princess of Friendship? Of course we recognize her, but that doesn't mean it's really her. Mm -hmm. It's okay, guys. Good to see that there neither of these guys is Flash Sentry. Spike the Brave and Glorious is a friend of the Crystal Empire, am I right? Hmm. Huh. It does look like him. Well, it would, wouldn't it? I'm sorry, but we'll need to see some proof of identification. We'll take care of things from here. There we go. Oh, Cadence, thank goodness. What's going on? We can explain, Twily. If it really is you. Even he's not sure. Okay. <laughs> Serious. <Sunshine>. Serious. <laughs> Great to see that again. But yeah, okay, serious uh, changeling problem, her, apparently. Right? And there's that thing. Of course it's her! What's all this about? A changeling's been spotted nearby. A changeling? That's not good. No, it's not. After Queen Chrysalis took my place at our wedding and invaded Canterlot with her army of minions, we're not taking any chances. Yeah. Changeling speed off of love. Great exposition for the people who missed that episode. <laughs> More love than anywhere in Equestria. It's possible they've come for the baby. That's why we posted the extra guards, and why we're checking every pony's identity. I'm sorry for all of this. Flurry Heart's really been looking forward to seeing you. <gasps> oh, she's gotten so big. Starlight and I will do whatever we can to help her. Doesn't look that different to me, but to be honest, having you here is already a big relief. Hmm. The royal guards were wondering if Spike, the brave and glorious, would like to join in the search for the changeling. Really? Uh, I don't know if that's such a good idea, Spike. It sounds dangerous. Come on, Twilight. This is Spike, the brave and glorious you're talking to. Have you ever known me to run from danger? Um, yeah. Be safe with our guards. Or will your guards be safe with me? Uh... Spike the Brave and Glorious. You face the evil change. Okay, and now it's a Spike episode. <laughs> oh, uh, well, they are changing, so they can change. Good that? job. These monsters can look like any of us, so be on guard, guards. Even more than normal. And they nice. can be anywhere. <laughs> so, we should cover as much ground as possible. You, search that way. And you, search that way. And I'll just search here, I guess. Good job, Spike. <laughs> just Unless that just rock go ahead and leave yourself that? unguarded. Okay, rock. How do I know you're really a rock? Hmm. Not talking, huh? Well, you can't fool me. Oh. Wow. Oh, that's kind of cool. Nice. Uh, animation there. Yeah. Okay. Maybe it's time Spike the Brave and Glorious went back to uh, protect those guards. Ah! <sighs> Just my reflection. No, no, that's the changeling. Huh? <laughs> hmm. Just my imagination, I guess. <laughs> Bad job hiding it. So where's this gonna go? Great. <laughs> that a David Bowie reference? No one is talking. Okay. First time we've seen a uh, changeling other than Chrysalis talk. The ice is pretty slippery. I wouldn't want you to get hurt because of me. You saved me? 
It's okay. I know you don't want to be friends. Interesting voice for what? a changeling. <laughs> I don't understand. Changelings are supposed to be evil, right? Evil? Oh, well, not me. All I've ever wanted is a friend. From the moment I first split my egg in the oh, nursery hive. Getting some <laughs> baby changelings. Adorable. Chrysalis. Part of the attack on Canterlot during the royal wedding, but I'd never seen true friendship like that, and I couldn't just steal it and feed on its love. Aww. I wanted to share it. After that, I knew I couldn't live with my kind anymore. Okay. I set off looking for love to share. Aww. But what? I'm starving, and there's so much love in the Crystal Empire right now. It's what drew me here. But it's driving me crazy! That would be from the Royal Crystalline. It's pretty much a giant outpouring of light and love for a new baby. <sighs> oh, sorry. I'm just so hungry. If I had a friend, maybe the love we shared could sustain me, but I don't think the Crystal Ponies want to be friends. What if I told you? Okay, so Spike's you gonna make so a uh, changing friend. So much, he could convince them to give it a try. If only that were true. It is! I mean, I am! It's me, Spike! Spike, the brave and glorious? I'm sure you've heard of me. No, but I was raised by an evil queen. I'm Thorax. I Thorax, huh? you want to help me. <laughs> what? Hasn't any pony ever just been nice to you? <sighs> yeah, probably so not. Sorry. Kindness like that kind of brings it out. Do you still want to be my friend? Of course! And I am 100% sure I can get the whole Crystal Empire to be your friend, too. <laughs> but maybe I should just, uh, talk to them first. Yeah. yeah. What do you mean? Did you see the changeling? Did you defeat the evil creature? <laughs> Defeating a changeling would be brave. But do you know what would be glorious? Defeating two changelings? <laughs> Defeating all the changelings? <laughs> <laughs> that would be pretty glorious. Because I made friends with him. <laughs> oh, wow. For a second, I thought you were serious. <laughs> Could you imagine friends with a changeling? I am yeah. serious. He wants to be friends. <laughs> You've got your work cut out for you here, Spike. Not only are you Spike the Brave and Glorious, you're also Spike the Hilarious. <laughs> I'm not joking. The changeling is nice. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I don't think it's funny. The changeling queen Chrysalis kidnapped Cadence and cast a spell on me. There's no such thing as a nice changeling. Oh wow, well, shining armor. <laughs> shining armor. Sorry. That was a bad joke. So, so, uh, what did they say? How many new friends do I have? Well, it didn't go exactly the way I thought. No, oh, I understand. Well, thanks for trying. I, I guess it's not surprising. How can you expect ponies to look like this? To trust something that looks like this? I think I might know. Spike, if you're done searching for the changeling, you're just Starlight gonna expect him to stay working on a protection in pony form all the time. Huh? And no pony takes notes like you. Uh, actually, Twilight, I, uh, wanted to introduce you to my friend, uh, a Crystal, uh, Hoof! Crystal Hoof! Wow, that's quite my the name. friend, Crystal Hoof. Nice to meet you. Oh, well, it's nice to meet you, too. How do you know Spike? Oh, uh, Spike and I go way back. To the Equestrian Games! That's when we met. We've been pen pals ever since. Pen pal Spike? You could have been using my pen pal quill set! What did you tell me? Well, I... I pretty much only write to him when you and Starlight are studying. I like to brag to all my friends about my letters from Spike the Brave and Glorious. 
Yeah. <laughs> uh, not well, awkward at all. Crystal and I can manage if you want to spend time with your friend. Great. Crystal Hoof promised to take me around the city. Oh, that was amazing. I told you. Crystal Hoof is nearly as entertaining as Spike himself. Oh, this place is everything I've ever dreamed of. But I can't keep pretending to be a crystal pony forever. Can yeah, I, I uh... Relax. Not sure you can. Over. Pretty soon, no pony will care that you're a changeling. Spike! Twilight told me you were off with a friend. <laughs> And any friend of Spike the Brave and Glorious is a friend of mine. Aww. <laughs> oh, she's so beautiful. There's so much love around her. I... I... <laughs> yeah, and now the truth comes up. Down the changeling. I'm pretty sure he doesn't want to see me. Spread out! The changeling is probably still nearby. Actually, I'm pretty sure he ran as far away from here as possible. But I bet I know where. Thorax! Hello! I just want to apologize. I should have stood up for you. Well, oh, come on, Thorax. I know you're in here! Oh, he was- okay! <laughs> um, a little help? Why do you think I would help you? I'm an evil changeling. Because you're my friend. I just wish I had been one to you. There we go. It's okay. I know it's hard. Everyone in the Crystal Empire loves you. I couldn't ask you to give that up for me. You don't have to ask. What are you gonna do? What I should have done in the first place. Go Spike. I know it's bad that there's a changeling around, but is all this really necessary? If there's one changeling, there may well be a whole army on the way. True, but Starlight has a point. This is getting a little out of hand. I understand, but I don't know what else we can do. I do! Mike! What are you doing? Get away from that thing! No, he's not a thing! His name is Thorax, and he's my friend! <laughs> Okay. Are we gonna get a? Would you say yeah. A hero? <laughs> Here we go. Glory About time. If I told you something you wouldn't believe, that sometimes I'm scared and I can make mistakes and I'm not so heroic. It seems. 
But if day can turn to night and the darkness turn to light, then what can Not the kind of spike song I would have expected getting. is not amused. How's this going to go over? <laughs> Spike, I'm so proud of you. You are? Of course. You're a celebrity here in the Crystal Empire, and you just risked all of it for a friend. I can't imagine anything more brave than that. As the Princess of Friendship, I try to set an example for all of Equestria. But today, it was Spike who taught me that a new friend can come from anywhere. I guess every pony still has things to learn about friendship, even me. And if Spike says Thorax is his friend, then he's my friend too. Aww. Thank you. But on behalf of the Crystal Empire, okay. I would like to extend my hoof in friendship, and I'm sure all of my subjects are. Guess all here. you need to do is sing a song. Welcome to the Crystal Empire, Thorax. I'm sorry we didn't take the time to get to know you. Maybe we can change that now. That'd be so amazing! I want to know all about friendship, and maybe one day I can take that knowledge back to the Changeling Kingdom. If my kind learn how to create love for one another, maybe they wouldn't have to take it from others. To spike the brave and glorious! <laughs> Looks like you were right after all. Right about what? Friendship lessons can happen anywhere. <laughs> That's a great note. Great note to end on. Okay. So, uh, yeah, this is what the show needed. This was a great episode, and I really, really enjoyed it. Uh, big, big step up from last week and the week before, and uh, just really overall enjoyable. Uh, and it's kind of interesting uh, how this season we've gotten two Spike episodes now, and both of them have been just really cool episodes, really exciting, interesting episodes where we get, like, just interesting stuff. Uh, we got the dragons and now a, a changeling centered episode with Spike. That is yeah, that's kind of unexpected and pretty cool. They're definitely stepping it up when it comes to Spike and doing more interesting things with him which I really appreciate. And uh, we finally even let him sing, which uh, 
It really wasn't the kind of song I would have ever expected to get from Spike, and I don't know if it's kind of the song that really suits him. Uh, not that it sounded bad. I think uh, Kathy did a pretty good job of it, and uh, it sounded pretty good, though, I mean, uh, something a little more upbeat might have suited his vocals better and uh, just sounded a little better, but... Uh, I think this is the song that might kind of grow on me after a few listens, I don't know. Uh, and it, it definitely was a really beautiful sequence, and uh, just drove home the point of the episode that people should just give others a chance and not really judge them based on the past and all sorts of things like that, which, I mean, is pretty obvious stuff, but it was done well here, and uh, it was understandable from both sides, I mean, given the history, uh, and uh, it was... It was just overall all really great stuff, and uh, I, I am kind of surprised, though, that this is what the Changeling from uh, the premiere amounted to. Rather than any kind of setup for a grand finale, it was just this one-off episode where we have Spike make a Changeling friend. Uh, I think that might disappoint some people. Might have a bit of uh, <laughs> might have a bit of Equestria game syndrome there, where. Uh, <laughs> A little bit of build-up, and all it is for is a Spike episode. I don't know. <laughs> or maybe this is setting something up. Maybe there is going to be more with the Changelings in the finale. Maybe uh, Thorax will have to stand up to them at that point, and uh, they'll do more of him. That would be kind of cool. Uh, could happen, too. I, I don't know. Uh, that would be... It wouldn't surprise me too much, though. Or maybe the finale will be something else entirely. Uh, who knows? Still got, like... <laughs> quite a few episodes left to go before we get to it. Uh, but yeah, this this was really good. Really just well done episode. Really enjoyable. And uh, it brought back a lot of stuff. We had Starlight again and Sunburst, though we didn't really do much. And it's always good to see uh, Shining Armor and Cadence. Uh, <laughs> love how they brought back the the, sun, the Sunshine and Sunshine thing. That That is really just always great to see. <laughs> and... Uh, yeah, it, it was it was just overall all really good, and uh, I'm really glad that we that we got an episode this enjoyable after a couple disappointing weeks. And uh, yeah, hopefully uh, this is something that builds momentum, and the next few will be great too. Anyway, hope you liked the commentary. Let me know if you did, and see you in the next one.